100 fighter jets were involved, and U.S. defense officials think that this could have been a dry run for a bombing of Iran's nuclear facilities. Israeli leaders have said that they will attack if Iran continues to develop its nuclear program, and this exercise certainly sends a strong message that they're ready to go. And with us now is Jeremy Ben Ami, who is the executive director of J Street, which is a pro Israel, pro uh, peace lobbying firm. Jeremy, great to see you. Thank you very much. Now, uh, this is quite something, isn't it? And meant to send quite the message to Iran after Mahmoud Ahmadinejad this week said, check, we won the nuclear game. We've won. What does that tell you? Well, it certainly sends a lot of signals. I mean, it sends signals to Iran, it sends signals here in the U.S. and in Europe. Uh, and it's within Israel's right to run these exercises, flex its muscles, and show what it's willing to do. What should the United States, though, do? Because we have, we have a lot of moving uh, pieces on